Hey, you guys, it's Mrs. Alexander. Um, I've been seeing some issues with multiplication and understanding how we multiply. So I'm going to do some clarification of the order. Now, when we read, we read left to right. When we do orders of operations, we do left to right. But when we multiply, you guys, we actually go right to left. So I'm going to write some numbers. I'm going to do 345, and I'm going to multiply it, multiply by, let's do pretty uh, colorful ones, by 72. So I'm going to put my 2 here and my 7 here. Okay, you guys, I'm trying to use all different colors so you can see how this goes. So my 2, I'm going to use um, the yellow. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do 2 times 5. Number 1, 2 times 5. And we know that 2 times 5 is 10. So we drop my zero and we carry my one, okay? Next, number two, we do two times eight plus one. And two times eight plus one is, two times four is eight plus one is nine. And then you guys, we do the third step. We do two times three. 2 times 3 is 6. We put the 6 down. I need to scroll this up just a little bit, you guys. And I did not write this as my 3. Now I'm going to quick use this so you guys can see what my numbers are. 1, 2, 3. And then, remember, this becomes 70. So I put my zero down because I'm multiplying by a tens number, 70. Not just seven, but 70. And then I start the process all over. I start off with seven times five. You're right, it's 35, you guys. So I'm gonna write my five down. This goes away and I gotta add a three. Then I do my number two again, seven times four plus three. So seven times four is 28 plus three, 31. Good job. So I drop my one, I carry my three. Now I go to my third number and now I do seven times three, 21, and I need to add the three. So 21 and three is 24. So as long as I have written this nice and neat so that all my numbers are in place value form, we're fine. Now we add it, zero plus zero, nine plus five. And I carry my one, because we're regrouping. Six plus one, plus one, eight, good job. Four plus zero, and two plus zero. So make sure you follow the pattern. You do the ones column, the tens column, the hundreds column. Then you multiply with the tens column by bringing our zero down and then doing the ones column, the tens column, the 100 column. Now remember, when we multiply, we go right to left and make sure we hit every digit. I hope this helped clarify the misunderstanding of multiplication. I hope you have a good day. Remember to smile, giggle, and wiggle. Bye.